The Medical Counseling Committee commonly known as MCC has released the NEET UG 2023 counseling brochure. The authority has made significant changes in the NEET counseling process this year. For NEET qualified candidates seeking to participate in the counseling process, Careers360 presents a helpful video guide on how to apply for NEET 2023 counseling, simplifying the process for students and parents. The NEET UG Counseling 2023 will be conducted in four rounds, namely Round 1, Round 2, Round 3 and Stray Vacancy Round. To participate in the NEET Counseling 2023 for 15% AIQ seats, candidates must first register themselves on the official website that is mcc.nic.in by providing their personal details, NEET UG score and other required information. It must be noted that candidates who have registered themselves for Round 1 counselling will not have to undergo fresh registration for Round 2 and Round 3. However, fresh registration is required for stray vacancy round. While registering for NEET counselling, candidates will have to pay a non-refundable registration fee and refundable security fee. After registration, Candidates need to fill in their preferred choices of colleges and courses based on their eligibility and preferences. In each round, seat allotment will be done based on the NEET UG rank, choices filled and seats availability. Candidates can accept the allotted seat or opt for an upgrade in subsequent round. Candidates who are allotted a seat must report to the designated college within the stipulated time frame to complete the admission process. When reporting, they need to carry all the necessary documents and certificates for verification. Candidates who will be allotted seats in Round 1 and 2 and want to upgrade to subsequent round will have to physically report with original documents to the allotted college. Candidates who will be allotted seats in Round 2 but do not join the allotted college will have to forfeit their security amount. In case of Round 3 seat allotment, if any candidate does not join the allotted seat, will be allowed to exit with for feature of fee and will not be allowed to participate in further rounds. On the other hand, if a candidate is granted a seat in stray round, he or she will have to necessarily join the allotted seat, otherwise will be debarred from NEET examination for one year along with for feature of fees. We sincerely hope that this video will enlighten your NEET 2023 counselling journey. In case of any query, feel free to ask your question in the comment section below.